Hey, online entrepreneurs. If you're ready to sell t-shirts, but you don't have a mega budget for product photos, today's video is for you. It's Grace here from Print Best, your print on demand partner. And we're going to show you how to get product images based on your budget size. This video covers four budget sizes, a $0 budget, a small budget of up to $100, a medium one up to $300, and a large one of more than $300. You'll want to stick around for all of them though, because even though you might not have a large budget now, there may come a day when you're ready to scale up your business. But first, we want to hear from you. What is your photo budget like? Comment below whether you're just starting out with minimal funds or you've allocated a big budget for product photos. Now, let's briefly mention the importance of good product photos. Think back to the last time you saw a product online. Chances are the first thing you looked at was the photo. And while there are many factors that affect your decision, the photo plays a large role. In fact, a study from Justumo found that for 93% of consumers, visual appearance is a key factor in making a purchasing decision. We won't bore you with more statistics, but if you want to see a few more stats about product photos, check out our blog article, which is linked in the description below. And this is just to say that it's super important to have good photos in your online store. Now the question is, how do you get them? The good news is you can get them for free. So if you're just starting your first t-shirt business and you don't have a budget for photos, here's how to get decent images for $0. You have two methods. The first method is extremely easy and great for those who are busy or don't have a lot of time. Print on demand companies usually have free mock-up generators that can create a picture of a model wearing your custom designed clothing. So for example, let's look at the mock-up generator at PrintBest. You select the garment that you want to customize and upload your design. Then you click generate preview and add to store. Once you select the color and the size variations that you want, our system will automatically generate mock-ups of your new products. This method is quick, simple, and it's perfect for beginners. If you have some more time on your hands and a little creativity, there's another free method to generate images. You can also use a free graphics website like FreePic to download a blank t-shirt stock image. Then using a free photo editing software like GIMP, you can edit your design onto the image. This method gives you more control over your branding and you can customize images, but it does take a lot of time and practice to get it right. Both of these methods are completely free. You don't even need to order the product yourself to take pictures. But let's say that you have a small budget and you're willing to pay a little bit for better images. There are three things you can do to step up the game. The first thing you can do is to take your own photos. Simply order a few samples and take pictures using your phone or camera. This way you can style your photos exactly the way you want. You can custom tailor the lighting, the angle, the background, everything that you need to make your photo reflect your branding and to attract customers. A report by Vengage compared original images to stock photos. 40% of marketers said that original images did best, while only 13% said stock photos. So taking your own photos also shows the product more accurately than a stock photo or an auto-generated mock-up. The second thing you need to do is pay for better editing software. Good software can save lots of time using functions that aren't available in free software, and often they produce more professional results. Keep in mind that there can also be a steep learning curve here, but if you have the patience, it's well worth it to learn the basics. If you don't have the time to learn photo editing, there's a third option, which is hiring a freelancer to edit your photos. As professionals, they know how to make images look their best so that the product listings can attract more customers. Plus, they have paid software at their disposal, so you don't have to buy these programs yourself. Now, let's take things up a notch to a medium level budget. Here, you're looking at anywhere from $100 to $300. At this point, you're ready to hire a model. How much it costs depends on how long the photo shoot will take. If you have a lot of products to capture, you're looking at the higher end of the budget. Keep in mind that it takes time and organization to plan a photo session with a model. Make sure you order the right size t-shirts well in advance and choose a well-lit location. You can also brainstorm ways to make your photos more reflective of your brand. The same goes for choosing a model. Think about what your target audience would want. What kind of model would be the most relatable to them? For more tips on working with live models, we've added a link in the description to a helpful article by Pixels. Before we cover the last budget level, we want to encourage you to like and subscribe to the Print Best channel. 
As you can see from this video, we believe that the size of the budget should not limit your business potential. That's why we create videos to help entrepreneurs and artists make money online. Be sure to turn on the notifications and don't miss the helpful videos that we have in store for you. Now, the last budget category that we're going to cover is for businesses that have a few hundred dollars to spend on product photos. While you might not be at that point right now, it's something to keep in mind and move towards as you grow your business. With a large budget, you can hire professional photographers and models for your photos. You can choose between freelancers or agencies. With agencies, you tend to spend a little bit more, but they also help you with organizing, which saves you time. You can even ship the products directly to them and let them take care of the entire process, including editing the images. Just be sure to clearly communicate what kind of images that you're going for. The result is very professional photos made to look exactly how you want them to, reflecting your brand and relating to your customers. It also saves you time and energy that you can spend on other aspects of your business. Today's video covered how to get product photos for your t-shirt business, depending on the size of your budget. If you're looking for more details, our blog article contains a full list of pros and cons for each of the strategies mentioned in this video. You can check that out in the link in the description below. And if you're looking to grow your t-shirt business, don't forget to visit printbest.com for affordable print-on-demand t-shirts, hoodies, and more. Our prices are on average 20% lower than other suppliers so that we can help sellers like you maximize your profits. Good luck, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.